Hi, what's going on, guys? So, been a, been a week or two here, and um, well, I'm finally back. Finally, had some time to play some games. Uh, but just been working a lot of work and uh, getting outside a lot, too, working out, running, biking. My foot's all healed up, so I've been out in the park a lot, just just trying to get back uh, into full speed. I'm there, so I uh, finally had time for some games. And now we've been playing Portal 2. Uh, pretty much last, the last five days or so. I picked that up over Mortal Kombat. I did pre-order the Mortal Kombat Fight Stick Bundle, and I canceled that pre-order sometime in March. Uh, I just didn't feel like I was going to pay $150 for the Fight Stick in that game. Um, I'll, I'll check out the game when it goes down in price. I'm just not too interested in another fighting game now. I'm still I'm still playing Super, Super Street Fighter 4, and I'm still enjoying Marvel vs. Capcom 3, so um, I was really looking forward to Portal 2. Like, the narrative in this game is just really good. The game is really funny, um, and, you know, you think, I'm sure some younger people would think, oh, I'm not going to play a game with no enemies and no guns. Uh, that's not really the point of the game. The point of the game is to get you in the mindset of using these portals to do these tests. And uh, once you uh, actually beat the game, which I just did about an hour or so ago, um, you know you really want to you want to do more. And then um, the the end of the game kind of initiates in the cooperative uh, testing, and then you can start doing it with your friends online. Well, you can't do it online on the PlayStation Network right now because that's down. But uh, you could do. Um, and split screen stuff, and basically you go through all the tests with friends and stuff, and you know just hear the hear all the funny and uh, the amusing dialogue and stuff like that. So uh, this had a really good storyline. I was amazed. I mean, it took, I I started playing this game with nothing, with no uh, you know no understanding of the game. I haven't played the first Portal. I will probably check it out now. Uh, I didn't know what I was getting into with this game. I knew somewhat. But not much. I knew like who the, I knew that there was a robot lady in charge or whatever who liked to perform tests, and that was it. So it really the game really led me on. I I played this game nonstop, just straight through. Um, you, you go around to shoot portals around, making things go through the portals, and there's just a lot of story, just rich, uh, elusive story in this game. And I'm playing it a second time, and I've started it over a few times already, just for fun, and just to hear it and see it. So yeah, um, definitely, a, definitely a game to pick up. Um, you know, if you just want a great, just a great fun game to play, something new, something new and fresh out there that'll make you think, think really fun. So yeah. Now, I also received a package, um, it was more or less a purchase. I sold one of my games, uh, a copy of Die Hard I had, to uh, Arcade Game Table up in Ontario. Um, he said, you know, he also found a, uh, a copy of the Nintendo Power Strategy Guide 4 Player Extra. This was one of my least favorite guides as a kid. I didn't care for this one at all. I was like, I never play these games except for Gauntlet. But nowadays, I just love looking through here. I love seeing all the pictures. I love seeing all the, uh, you know, the, the writing and the sprites and how they just fill up a whole page talking about one game. This is funny. So that's really interesting there. Thank you. Thank you, James. I uh, purchased at a donation store and covers a rough shape, yes, but the inside pages are near mint. So, thank you and happy game at Arcade Game Table. So, thank you. And your package is it's packaged up and it's actually, I got it right here. I'm going to drop it off in the post today. Um, I'm shipping everything overseas, actually, to Canada. I'm shipping them just with insurance and everything. I had somebody not get a package and then ended up having to have his stuff sent back to him to really think of another way to do it. So, um, so trading, I am just slowed down trading for now. I don't have the money to be spending, especially after having to resend stuff and whatnot. So, um, James, I got that coming to you, and then I know there are like one or two of you I was talking to about some other games, but you know, there's no hurry ever, and uh, you know, I'm in no hurry to get any more trades going right now. I'll probably have another trades video up, I'd say, in about a month or two. I, I want to say about a, two months, and I'm going to just have a big trades video. I'm starting to catalog the things I'm keeping. I'm actually going to be moving out in about a month, so I'm cataloging the things I'm going to be taking with me, things I'm keeping, things I'm selling. So in the next, I'd say the next... Yeah, four to six weeks, four to eight weeks. Look for a really big, uh, you know, 
know, big sale, trade video, whatever. Um, I'm going to have a lot of good stuff up there. So, so let's see, anything else new that I haven't uh, talked about? Not really. Um, yeah, so I'm just really enjoying Portal 2. Uh, like I said, I know a lot of people play in World Combat. Um, I played the demo, but I haven't picked up that game quite yet. Uh, so I will like to play it. I did watch the video of all the fatalities and stuff, so... Um, you know, it was a day when you had to work to see those things, when I just watch a video, so it kind of spoils it for everybody. But yeah, so check out Portal 2, and uh, once again, thank you James for the gift here, and for the game purchase, and I will see you guys later. Happy gaming, peace!